At least they making moves. At least they making moves, bro. My team, we're going to segue what into te- it. What team is this? The Dallas Cowboys. Oh, God, I heard of them. So, it. let's go through the timeline here, right? The Cowboys lose to the Packers. Cowboys Nation, livid, livid. upset, frustrated, confused, dazed and confused. Don't understand what just happened. We just got the doors blown off of us by the youngest team in the NFL, right? Don't what's going on? We think that Mike McCarthy's gonna be fired, right? Hey, he's gonna go. Harbaugh's here. We're gonna get him. Belichick, yeah. We got Jerry Jones saying we're 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 gonna go all in. We're gonna go all in, right? So everybody's thinking, this is gonna be the go end. All, in. all in. That sounds fucking amazing, right? As a Cowboys fan. Well, unbeknownst to us. As Cowboys fans, and people who are old school Cowboys fans, they probably have already known this was coming because Jerry Jones is the master gaslighter. Mm-hmm. That's what he does because they were starting to sell shirts on the Cowboys website all in. <laughs> you know how so to you make don't, a buck, so bro. the man knows how to make a buck because the fans said, We're going all in. That means I got to buy season tickets. I got to make sure because I, I'm expecting big moves to happen. Let me go ahead and spend this 20K real quick, right? Oh, no. No. Stephen Jones came out and said, oh, oh, what we meant to say was all in means we want to keep our own guys. I yeah. Talking, I was talking about a poker so, game when I said that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> all in, that means like, you know, keep it here and then put push everything to the middle of the table. Right. That doesn't mean that we're getting other stuff outside. Should have no. said all even. <laughs> that mean exactly. That means that we're getting we're going to keep Dak Prescott. We want to keep uh uh um Micah Parsons, we want to keep CD Lamb. We want to keep all our players that we have here, keep the core together. Last time I checked, Tyron Smith is a jet. Biotish is a commander. <laughs> Dexter Fowler, or whoever that Fowler, whatever the name, Dante Fowler, he's a commander. Mad Cowboys is going off the board. You talking about keep the core together? We ain't got no core. The media thought Derrick Henry was going to be a Cowboy. Derrick Henry the bought media. a house in Texas. <laughs> oh, house in Texas. Got Man it. had an interview and said, I would love, love to play for the Cowboys. Man didn't get a phone call. I got some. I got some for him. I'm not done. Get your money back. Man, got a, <laughs> Man didn't get a phone call, right? Aaron Jones. Went for seven, eight million dollars to the to the to the Vikings. No running back besides Saquon Barkley, and and uh and Jacobs got a big deal. Everybody got marginal deals, right? Zach Moss, four million dollars <laughs> to the Bengals. Woo. That's it. That's it. We ain't got a running back. You know what we got Deuce Vaughn. Yeah, Deuce. five four Deuce Vaughn. Deuce. You can't. Operate. Listen, in football, yes, you have to operate through the draft, right? Draft is very important in football. It's very important. But you also have to add impact yeah. players in free agency when available. Not saying to spend everything. But a lot of impact. reasonable guys went. A lot of guys That's went for reasonable prices. The, the running back position in the free agent market is bountiful. There's mad running backs out here. If you did not get one, now granted... There's still time, but all the big guys are off the board. Exactly. And you have right. a good enough line to support a mediocre right. running back. Every, yo, every Cowboys fan was like, yo, all right, cool. All of these dudes, yo, we're going to get Quadzilla, AJ Dill. Did you offer him? He's back with Green Bay now. So now we're now we going. You can still get uh, who? J.K. Dobbins. We don't want him. Deontay uh, Foreman. We don't want him. J.K. Uh, Dobbins. Clyde uh, Edwards. We nah, definitely don't want him. We definitely don't want him. Nah. Still in the free market. Ain't no way. Hey, 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 here's a question for you. Yeah. What do you feel that the Cowboys need to do in order to avoid these issues? What do you, I don't understand the question. What do you feel that the Cowboys need to do to avoid these issues as far as free agency? You need a real GM. Let Jerry do the draft. That's what he's great at. Well, well, Will McClay is the one that does the draft. Let, let, well, what, hey, Will with McClay Jerry did. in his ear. Jerry is consistently no, Will, draft Will, great, great I think players. Will McClay is the guy. So do you think Jerry's doing a great job 
Or does he need to hand it over to somebody else? I don't else? think that Jerry's the one that's doing it. I think that Jerry has given Steven a lot of control. Steven is the penny pincher. Jerry isn't. Mm. That's the problem. Is that Jerry is looking to Steven like, okay, what do you think? No, we shouldn't spend that money, Dad. We need to spend it somewhere else. All right. If it's not the Jerry, Jerry... So Jerry, go ahead and spend it on somebody. That's what I thought. We're about to dive deep. Hold on. Do you feel that the Dallas Cowboys will potentially turn into the current Yankees after Jerry passes on ownership? Well, it's going to be a shit show. Okay. It's going to be a disaster. Okay. If Stephen Jones is going to be the one manning the ship, it's going to be bad. It's going to be really bad. And are you ready for that 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 voyage? Listen, I I want Dak gone. I, you already know that. I want. I hope that this is the plan this year. I hope that they go all in, right? Meaning that you don't give Dak an extension. You don't. You give CD Lamb his money. If you want to give Michael Parsons his money, fine. But you let Dak play on his fifty nine million dollar option, right? Go ahead and play, and then hit the road. Hit the road. I'd rather be bad. I, I'm. T- I've been saying this. You've been saying for years. months, yeah. for years, for years, I would rather be bad than be middle of the road. It's either you're gonna be at the top, the bottom. I don't want to be here, and the Cowboys are here every year, mm-hmm. every year. Very true. So what's the, so where is it gonna change? You got the you got the, uh, uh, what's 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 the dude name in, in Philadelphia? The the, the GM. Howie Roseman, right. he's out there working, wild, wild. working miracles, working every year. <laughs> I don't know where the money coming from, right? I don't know where the money coming from. Meek Mill, he's just signing people, right? <laughs> you got the Giants making improvements. You got the Commanders coming. Magic Johnson, there now. No, oh. you know, you know. I, he what does. I tell you, I said, give him two years. You know what yeah. he does. Give him two years. Hoorah! Before that shit start getting crazy over there, no more. Eggs. We are going to be the laughing stock of this of this uh, of this uh, division soon. Get rid of Dak. Just start from scratch. Give me a five and twelve season. That's what you need. Though. That's yeah, the you need that. You need to bottom out. So you need to bottom out so you can so get some good, good picks. Right, yeah, like because you're not gonna get a good quarterback. You're not gonna like get that. no good look, quarterback look like Detroit. that, bro. Look at Detroit. Look yeah. at Detroit. Look at look it at. It started. It started with the offensive line. I got it, bro. Look at Detroit. Look at Houston. Look at look at the Bengals. Look at all of these teams that had to bottom out to get what they wanted. Even the Browns to some degree. Browns. Oh, Browns. Facts. If it wasn't for that that Baker Mayfield era, they wouldn't be here. Yeah. And they bet, yo, they threw the bag. You know what I'm saying? Like you got to be bad to to ride. It's with a with a franchise like Dallas. If they're bad for a couple of years, they're gonna be able to get up and and build that the right way. You gotta be bad. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of Dak. 